Hi, my name is Nuska. I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the uh, Mega Frax 150. Um, for starters, you know, start the machine and plug it in. While you're waiting for the program to load up, you're going to uh, grab these two orange leads. There's going to be two. You're going to have the yellow, the red, and the black. Connect the yellow with the yellow here, you know, red with the red, black with the black. Pretty simple. You're also going to have two clamps. Take the other side of each orange lead, it doesn't matter which one. Plug uh, the orange and the yellow, they're together, into the one clamp and then the black into the second clamp. And then you're going to take your clamp uh, to the bus bar, wherever your connection is going to be. Here I'm doing a face-to-face -face connection and just uh, twist it right on there. And by the time that's done, uh, you should have, your program should have loaded up. It will load up all on its own. And after it's loaded up, you're going to go to File, uh, the top left corner, Load Test. And you're going to go to your uh, ABB Bit and Steel. And there I have uh, three tests already loaded for you, A, B, and C phase. And you can go hit uh, the impedance right here. It will bring you the proper graph that you want to see. Uncheck the log button in the top left and the bottom right. And then you're going to click on what one you're testing. So let's say we're doing A phase right now. And then you just go right here in the top right and you hit the test button. And you'll see the test running in real time. And you just let that run its course. And like I said, I did set up the data points for you. Um, if you wanted to change them, you can uh, hit this little button right there. It'll pull you into here. Right now I have you starting at 20 hertz and it's going down to 860 hertz. Uh, to make the test go faster, you uh, can separate it into different uh, sweeps. So you know, right now I have six different sweeps. You can add more, you can delete some. If you want to delete or edit any of them, just you have to click on it and then you can edit it in this row here, delete it here and set band there if you change anything and then hit OK and that will change whatever you want to change and then you can do your new sweep. If you want to add a sweep, uh, a, an additional one other than the three that I've added for you, you can go down here and hit add sweep and name it anything you want and like I said change any of those uh, data points as you wish. And then uh, when you guys are done with all your testing, if you wish to ever export it, there's on the left side of this a USB port. You just get a typical USB stick, go uh, to the top left corner, File, uh, hit Export, and then go into uh, My Documents. Just a sec. 